Mtazamaji wa Swift Media kuna story ambayo inazungumzwa sasa hivi kule mitandao ni story ya King of Mogidi Samido ambayo ilimfanyikia uh, kati ambapo alikuwa kule upande wa Gikomba aliibiwa akakoniwa na basi akaambiwa atoroke. Sasa hii ni story ambayo imewagusa wengi na nikaamua basi nikuletee na ni kupeleke moja kwa moja mpaka blog ya mpasho ambao walipublish hiyo story basi hakikisha kwamba una subscribe wakati ambapo na kuonyesha kile ambacho kilifanyika. Nao, hii ni blog ya mpasho hapa na ambao walipublish hii story ni wao Storia Entertainment na kuandika I was badly beaten and told to run. Samido recalls a day uh, he was conned in Gekomba. He was a trader in Gekomba market. Story hii iliandikwa na kezia gitau. Na basi wakandika the experience taught Samido to be uh, streetwise before he made a breakthrough in his career. Kasha picha yake na chini kabisa wakandika Mogidi Mr. Samuel Mushoki aka Samido has shared memories of the day he was conned while uh, he was a newcomer in Nairobi City. Samido posted a TBT photo accompanied by a moving narration of the unfortunate event when uh, he was working back in Gekomba. According to him, uh, uh, the experience taught him to be streetwise before he made a breakthrough in his career. Chini kabisa hapa wakayani kuu maneno ambayo Samido sasa aliyazungumza na kuandika uh, There was this time I was employed as a vendor in Gikomba market I have gone through a lot in this Nairobi to a point that when I see someone dropping money I can't pick it up It was at this time when I was working along I was walking sorry along OTC road when two people walked past me speaking English before a lady in a casual reached me up na basi wakaendelea kunukuma neno yake hapa na kuandika one of the gentlemen uh, said that he was carrying mercury and that he was feeling a bit dizzy and fainted the other gentleman requested uh, us to help him as he handed me a bag that uh, contained the mercury samido shared hapa sasa wakaandika the cons dumped samido and later assaulted him back then i had had that mercury and gold in Nairobi are very expensive do jamani the lady told me to steal uh, the bag and she knew a good place where uh, we could sell the mercury and became rich as naive i w- i was i believed that uh, i believed and followed the lady uh, to a room where we would sell the mercury on reaching the room I was badly beaten and told to run away while sounding like a car and if I looked back they would kill me he added basi uh, hayo ni maneno ambayo Samido aliyazungumza kupitia post ambayo uh, mpasho wanadai kwamba aliyepost kupitia mtandao wake wa Facebook basi mtazamaji kama haufahamu basi umepata kufahamu haya ni mambo ambayo mara nyingi sana huaga ya nafanyika huku Nairobi kwa hiyo you have to be very very careful na yule ambaye unapatana naye popote pale ambapo unaenda hakikisha kwamba unajichunga sana kwa sababu i say do yamani hapa Nairobi sio kuzuri alright mtazamaji wa Swift Media nataka uniambie hiyo story fupi imekufunza kitu gani mhm mimi imenifunza kwamba nisimwamini mtu yote wakati ambapo unaenda popote mm-hmm. kwa sababu si eti kwamba Nairobi tu ndio ambapo unaweza ukakoniwa pia kuna cities zingine kuna Nakuru kuna maeneo mengine tofauti imesha jaribu kunifanyikia lakini uh, hiyo nita share siku moja niwaeleze vile ambavyo ilinifanyikia mtu aliniambia ni seme our lord's prayer mara kumi na basi nita pata hela. Anyway, hiyo ni story, a story for another day. Anyway, mtazamaji, nataka uniambie story hiyo fupi ya Samidi imekufunza nini? Niambie hapo kwenye sehemu ya comments lakini subscribe hapa Swift Media ili kupata exclusive updates kama hizi. Kila wakati we are on a uh, road to 100,000 subscribers. Mbakisha subscribers kama elfu mbili hivi tunaingia laki moja na basi wengi wanauliza kwa nini tume hide subscribers basi tutawan hide hivi karibuni anyway ni follow instagram facebook twitter at @majokamjk and we are out